up next, it's a welterweight bout between Nick Diaz and Steven Thompson. Ready. You ready to fight? So here's the two-time UFC welterweight title challenger, Steven Wonderboy Thompson. He has really taken striking to a whole new level in modern-day mixed martial arts. One of the best pure kickers and karate practitioners to ever grace this UFC octagon. Steven Wonderboy Thompson back under the bright lights tonight. Good series of strikes by him there. Great job of mixing it up, staying active, keeping busy, doing great work. Diaz gets caught with that punch. Got to shore up the defense here. All right, so one minute into the fight, we've got a full-on brawl here, DC. It's great for the fans, not necessarily for the gas tank if this thing goes much longer. Not great for the gas tank and not good for the old noggin. You can't take so many upside the head. Somebody's going to sleep. Ooh, head kick lands from the hurt. Looking to land the right just out of range. Dig and kick. Nice one-two there. Nice body kick right under the elbow. Big ball from Clutch Land. Now we get back to green. Both fighters hanging down in the pocket and both landing. Wow. Man, it's almost like he's got a range finder out there. Just too easy as he connects with another good series of punches. If you're boxing this guy and only boxing him, you will be in trouble. Oh, he got absolutely bludgeoned. and that's as good a combination as we have seen out of him here tonight. The last time I saw a combination this good, it was Donald Cerrone beating up on Rick Story. All right, so he continues to use his jab effectively here, DC. He gets that hand to the target pretty quickly. I mean, just right away, blasting the jab after jab after jab. He's a phenomenal boxer with a vast understanding of fighting behind that educated jab. He has jabs. Oh! He's hurt. Serve him up. Go get him. Oh, he might be out. Oh, straight right. Oh! He's in trouble. Wow. He's hurt bad. He's out! It's over! It's over! Oh, my goodness, what a fight. I'm not sure if that's the way he drew it up, but a huge result for him here tonight as he gets the win by way of knockout. And that's about as good a one-strike finish as we've seen here in the UFC in recent memory. I'm not even sure the opponent saw it coming. So a big, big win for him here tonight. So a huge result and a seminal moment for him here tonight as he gets the big knockout win. That could hold up as one of the better KOs of the year.